previously on Minecraft Story Mode. Everything in the universe starts out as just a block. What comes of those blocks is up to those who need them. And in every block, there lies the potential to create or destroy. Our friends have traveled far and wide in search of the Order of the Stone. And a way to stop the Wither Storm for good. But even well-laid plans can go awry. The strong can grow weak. And beloved heroes can fall. And though some glimmer of hope may remain, the threat to this world, to its very existence, is far from over. even close. The what now? Who are you? Jesse, Jesse, where are you? Say something, Jesse. We're over here. No way, no way. You found Gabriel? Who's Gabriel? We need to get out of here now. This way. And Gabriel? Did you say Gabriel? Look out! Those Endermen are running the wrong way! They'll be killed! Soren? I can't stand by and watch! Soren, who cares? Who cares? I've devoted my entire life to these creatures! So you're ready to die for them? Well, no. <coughs> Jesse! They're falling behind! Axel, you gotta move faster! She's too sick! This is the best we can do! They're not gonna be able to outrun it! Not on foot! We gotta find a way to move faster! We're all gonna be caught in the tractor beam! Can we build a portal? If somebody has the right materials... We don't! I haven't seen Obsidian since the end. We'll have to use the next best thing. Everybody, get on! You 
could use a little practice. First time on a horse here. Watch it! You try to knock me off this thing, Jesse? Sorry. made it. Jesse, Gabriel was saying some pretty weird stuff back on that horse. He might have wither sickness. I don't know. You never acted the way he's been acting. I'll go talk to him. Hey, how are you feeling? I'm afraid I don't feel much like myself at the moment. Gabriel, it really is you. They told us you'd kicked it. Uh, who are you people? It's me. Magnus! Old friend, don't you recognize us? It's Soren. Just give him some space for now. He may still come out of it. <sighs> what a terrible turn of events. You! You're the one who rescued me! Tell me, please, what is going on? I remember only blackness. And then... Suddenly, you were there. And then we were galloping. Gabriel, all that matters is you're safe now. And among friends... I don't feel safe. All I feel is the horror of being in that monster. It was dark and foul, and I was sure I was a goner. Well, you aren't. You made it back alive. Which is more than I can say for some of us. Oh, man. Ellie. For a second, I almost managed to forget. You guys talking about Eligard? I just can't believe she's gone. It doesn't feel real. How? How could this have happened? To lose not just a friend. She knew the risks, and she still let me take her armor. She was really something else. Even if she did make me feel like the dumbest guy in the world sometimes. Ah! Being emotional is getting us nowhere! What 
I want to know is what happened out there today? Why is that thing still alive? My instructions were simple. You tell me. Excuse me? Well, you're the one who thought we could destroy the command block with a big old bomb. So the command block is still out there? Of course it is. Oh, great. And now, to make matters worse, we've gone from one weather storm to three. Our plan was a total failure. I should have cast the foul thing into the abyss. Soren, why didn't it break? The Formidabomb was, like, the strongest weapon imagined. Oh, uh, why are you asking me? Nobody's ever built one until now. Ugh. <sighs> I need a moment to think. Is he always like this? <laughs> you have no idea. That jacket! I recognize it! Lucas always wears that jacket. No. There were other people wearing that very same jacket when I was thrown from the monster! Ugh. It hurts just to think about. Hey, hey! It's okay. Jesse, if what Gabriel said is true, I mean, do you think? I thought for sure they were gone, but... Lucas, your friends could still be out there! I know, and that means I... I gotta go after them. They might need me, Jesse. Whoa. I suddenly feel really dizzy. Easy, easy. I gotcha. Hey, buddy. You doing okay? Of course you are. Wish I could say the same for everyone else. Petra, how are you doing? You look terrible, Petra. Your skin is, like, almost gray. Hey, way to not sugarcoat it. I feel even worse than I look. Man, if it wasn't for Ivor, she wouldn't even be like this. Ah, no kidding. That's... Not exactly true. Ivor built the Wither, sure, but he couldn't have done it without that skull I gave him. If I'd just taken a second to think about it, all I cared about was getting that stupid diamond. Just know, I'm gonna do everything I can to make this right. Petra, I know this isn't easy to hear, but... You're too sick to be going anywhere. I'm not that sick. Maybe you should rest in this cave for a while. I mean, it's safe, defensible. If I say I'm fine, then I'm <coughs> fine. If you try to keep going, I'm afraid you're not going to make it. No, no way. I'm not a quitter. We're not saying you are. I can do this, guys. Sorry, Petra. It's two to one. You need to stay here and rest. But I want to be there for you guys. Come on, Petra. You can't even hold a sword. Maybe you're right. Gravel? No. Dirt? <clears throat> Don't think so. <sighs> I'm not gonna lie, man. But we've pulled through worse, right? Have we? How's it going? Tell me, Jesse, who is this person? He keeps insulting me. One minute I think I'm talking to a friend, the next I'm being made fun of. Dude, a Magnus. You know, the Magnus. <coughs> and how do I know this Magnus exactly? I sense we have a history, but I feel I need a little reminder. I'm sorry. I'm trying, but there's nothing. It isn't working. He doesn't remember. Talk to him about your past, something only you would know about. Like what? It's been so long since we've seen each other. Talk a little about Eligard. Eligard, yes. I was... Uh... Really something. Smart, in a bit. funny, amazing with redstone. Play your play. Heck, uh, she was the one person among us who didn't even need the... Uh, the didn't need yeah. the what? Yeah. You know, uh, never mind. Point is, you liked her. A lot. We all did. Thank you for sharing that with me. And Jesse. 
thank you, too. You've been a big help here. I, uh, I need to repay your kindness. I'm not sure how exactly. It's no problem. I'd have done it for anyone. All the same, you have my thanks. Now then, tell me more about this Elagard. Man, I don't even know where to begin. over cobblestone might come in handy. Lucas, what are you doing? I told you. I'm going after my friends. I thought the other ocelots were dead, but if they're not, I need to go find them. Look, I am grateful to you guys for bringing me this far, but I can't leave them alone out there. And what if Gabriel's wrong? In case you haven't noticed, he's not exactly firing on all cylinders right now. I've got to try, Jesse. Otherwise, I just couldn't live with myself. But Lucas... Look, you and me, we've made a pretty good team so far. I'd even call us friends. So I hope you'll understand why I need to go help my old friends. they do it for me. Same way you'd go back for any of your friends. I can't believe I'm saying this, but... If your heart's telling you to go, then you gotta go. Otherwise, you'd be heartless or something. <laughs> Thank you, Jesse. I'll find them. And then I'll find you again, too. I promise. Thanks. You came along. Just don't tell Reuben I said that. He might get jealous. Reuben! Don't run off on me like that, okay? <laughs> Patrick didn't mean it, Ruben. She's just not herself right now. Yeah, I know. I, I wish she would get better, too. I hate to say it, but the order failed. Part of me was still holding out hope that they could fix things, but I guess I should have known better. You're really not making me feel better, Ruben. That's what I said, isn't it? And you need to listen to me. Oh, what good has ever come of that? Haven't you done enough, Ivor? Like, say, single-handedly destroying the entire world? Well, technically, I set in motion a series of events whose end result appears to it's be... It's the same thing! What you don't understand is, you are all in very grave danger. <laughs> Obviously! No. I mean specifically this group. The Witherstorm isn't acting randomly. It's following Gabriel. Gabriel? You see, I may have programmed it to follow his amulet. You mean the Order's amulet? That explains why the Witherstorm's been following us. 
I don't understand. Gabriel only just reappeared. I have the amulet, Ivor. I have all along. What? I... I didn't know. Ah, oh, Ivor, you fool. You've created a monster that's following Jesse, and it's only getting stronger. You don't think I realize that? Nothing can stop those things. Nothing even hurts them. Well, except Enderman. Enderman? Jesse's right. The Wither's gaze passed over them, and they went wild. Trouble is, we've had a few run-ins with Enderman, and they're bad news. Mm, not necessarily. Enough of them, working together, might ignore us and destroy a Witherstorm entirely. It's a promising concept, at least in theory, if I'm seeing all the pieces correctly. But to actually destroy a Witherstorm, we'd need hundreds of them. There's probably more than enough of them taking refuge in my fortress. An unintended side effect of you flooding the end. This is just like the old days, Soren. You and your crazy ideas... Hush, Ivor, for once! Ugh. Question is, how to bring the Storms and the Endermen together? Endermen aren't pets. They don't follow orders. At least, not for mere mortals. Wait, it's obvious. We simply bring the amulet back to my fortress. Soren, I like it. If we can't bring the Endermen to the Witherstorms, we bring the Witherstorms to the Endermen. Just one problem. You're forgetting about the command block. Ugh. Yes. It's clear now that no weapon can destroy it. Not even a formidable. Actually, I may have a solution to that. You see, when I first took possession of the command block... You mean, stole it? Yes, well, I created a failsafe. A backup plan, just in case. Well, I'd say just in case is here. Ivor, how could you keep this secret? Oh, believe you me, keeping secrets is easy. So I made something. An enchanting book. One that contains the power of the command block itself. Use it to enchant a weapon, and you'll be able to smash the command block to bits. Forever! Yes. Yes, that's it. It could very well solve all our problems. What are we waiting for? Let's go get that book. Just one problem. It's at my secret lab, which is sort of far away. How far could it possibly be? Let's just say it's the farthest place a person can travel before being utterly... Oh dear, what was that? Found us so quickly. It just keeps coming for us. Well, we can't stand around and wait for it. Guys, there's a reason it's been following us. Ivor says it's because of the amulet that Gabriel. Ivor! It is you! Good to see you too, Magnus. Hello, my name is Gabriel. Somebody pinch me. Anyway, Ivor's figured out that Witherstorms are drawn to the amulet, so we're gonna lure them back to Soren's fortress and destroy the command block with an enchanted super weapon. You figured all that out just now? The point is we need to get moving. We aren't safe. Not as long as we have that amulet. I'll take it. You can't. I can, and I have to. There's no way I can let you do that, Axel. You don't understand. I'm not asking. I thought you'd trust me by now. You just go make that super weapon. I'll meet you back at Soren's fortress. Well, Axel shouldn't have to do this alone. I'm coming with you, man. Nice. Well, I'm going with Jesse. I, I pledge to help, and that's what I must do. But Lucas is out there all by himself. There's nothing you can do for him. Never thought I'd be saying this, but Ivor, lead the way. Hey, Jesse, let's try our handshake again, just once for the road. The builder bump? You got it. Ha <laughs> ha. 
I'll see you at Soren's, all right? Not if I see you first. further now. Let's go. Uh, will you just shut up already? Rear end is profoundly sore. Feels like we've been riding forever. I am telling you, we cannot go to the Far Lands. They're not just the edge of our world, but the limits of our comprehension. Oh, please. The Far Lands are a happy accident. Nature's way of keeping life interesting. No, no, no. They are perilous and unpredictable. Purlin noise, floating points. These are not matters to be toyed with. Hold on, back up. What exactly are the Far Lands? Are you being serious? The Far Lands lie at the very edge of all things, where logic gives way to chaos. They're a dangerous place to visit, and a ridiculous place to construct a laboratory. <laughs> Just wait until you see it. Do those two never stop arguing? I don't know. I'm too hungry to care. No kidding. I'm starving. Maybe we should turn back? <sighs> This isn't the time. Swamps are too dangerous. You never know what might be lurking around. What was that? My stomach. Guys, we can't turn back now, not after coming so far. Fine, but I'm taking a break. So am I. We mustn't linger long. The Far Lands are just beyond this swamp. So this could be our last chance to find food? <laughs>
everyone doing okay? Not really. We're starving. Potato, you're coming with me. Not much, but it'll help. Hey, Jesse, have you found any food? I should probably take what I have back to the group. Witch's hut. Yeah. We should steer clear of it. Nothing good ever happens when witches are involved. Look, a cake! That's that's enough to feed everyone. It isn't worth it, Jesse. Witches hate trespassers. Besides, there are plenty of potatoes around. Is that a witch? <laughs> Jesse, we shouldn't be here. Witches are very strong. Let's get out of here. Good idea. <laughs> Guys! Jesse, did you find any food? Actually, yeah, some potatoes, but it'll have to wait. There's a witch nearby. We saw her creeping through the swamp. <laughs> She's here! <laughs> oh, no, you don't. Watch out for her potions. Skeletons? That's a deadly combination. Her potions combined with their arrows? The Far Lands are just past the swamp. But they've seen us. They'll just follow us. The rest of you. Go! I'll hold them off. What? Ivor, no! There's no time to argue. Just head for the corner of the glitch wall. The what wall? Hey, you witch! You're not the only one who can throw a potion. lost them for... Wow! You lost them for wow? What is that? Oh. Wow. It's like we're at the edge of the world. Actually, we seem to be at the corner of it. Welcome to the Far Lands, my friend. I'd feel a lot better about going into this crazy wall thingy if I wasn't still hungry. I'd rather be hungry than killed by a witch. I'd rather be eating dinner. <laughs> Quite a sight, isn't it? Stretching skyward in all its glory. This wall? Did Ivor build this? No, of course not. This is a natural phenomenon intersection of two of the great walls that form the boundary of our world. Incredible. You can say that again. Incredible. Ivor really went out of his way to make sure he'd never have visitors, huh? 
He was always secretive. It was both his weakness and his strength. Whatever Ivor is hiding in here, it will be extremely well guarded. This way, I suspect. I'd feel better about this if the rest of our group was with us. Come on! Is this... a maze? It would appear so. A massive one from the looks of it. If Ivor used the command block to build this, it could hold unspeakable peril. Why do I sense that entering this so-called maze would be a grave mistake? Because some part of you still knows Ivor. Unfortunately, this seems to be the only way forward. There has to be another way. A secret door, or... I don't know. We followed Ivor to the Far Lands. We might as well keep going. <sighs> Here we go. Into another dungeon of doom. but they are indisputably fascinating. We should probably keep moving. Guys, looks like this is a... Jesse! There's too many! We can't fight them all! Everyone, back! the vines well that worked I suppose yeah I guess but now what do we do we're all separated let's just head that way and find a place where the pads connect Sure hope they don't get lost in there. I hope I don't get lost in there. I think it's safe to say the far lands are strange.
Olivia. <laughs> What's that? Looks like Ivor kept some redstone dust handy. And a slime ball. See a way across. Huh, redstone blocks, some pistons. Wonder what this thing's supposed to be. Hello? Anyone? Olivia, is that you? Jesse, there you are. <coughs> I thought I'd never find you. Am I glad to see you guys? Us too. I thought Reuben and I would be lost in here forever. <coughs> This maze? We don't have time for this. Who even knows where the others are by now? I mean, the clock's ticking here, Jesse. Yet we're lost in some elaborate puzzle. Well, we've got to push on to Ivor's lab somehow. Too bad there's a gaping bottomless pit in the way. What about this thing? Could it get us across? It's some kind of flying barge. It would probably get us to the other side. But it's in really bad shape. And it's really complicated. You can fix it though, right? I don't know. I think it's out of my league. I wish I'd had more time to study with Eligard. Come on, you'll figure it out. You know you always do. <sighs> Fine. I'll take a look. This layout doesn't even make any sense. What was Ivor thinking? Or maybe it's just me. I mean, Eligard herself said I don't have what it takes to be a great engineer. She was right, I just can't hack it. I might as well be a carrot farmer. Who cares what she said? I do. She was the greatest redstone engineer ever. She was in the Order of the Stone. Sure, but the Order are still people, just like us. Right. Just like us. I mean, how are we the ones saving the world when even they don't have what it takes? Soren and Ivor are always at each other's throats. The greatest warrior in history doesn't remember his own name. All I ever see Magnus do is argue. And we both know what happened to Eligard. The Order can't do this. How are we supposed to? How are we supposed to do anything? We're nobody. You know what? We're better than them. Better than the Order? 
I don't know about that. I mean, they defeated an Ender Dragon. Can you name even one thing we've done right? And I don't mean managing to stay alive. Something that actually matters. Yeah, I can't either. Then again, maybe this is our chance. Ah, all right. I'll try it one more time. Wait a second. I think I see what he was trying to do. Jesse, take this piston, craft it into a sticky piston, then place it on the other side of the barge, along with a redstone block. You got all that? I think so. Sooner the better. Okay, a redstone block. Okay, let's put the redstone block where it's supposed to go and place these pistons. Holy cow, we did it! We need flint and steel to get it started. I'm proud of you, Olivia. Thanks, Jesse. And thanks for everything you said just before. It really helped. No problemo. It must be this way. Run! Hey, over here. Quick, onto the barge. Jesse! Everyone okay? For the moment. I remember something. Didn't Eligard build a machine like this once? Yes, in the nether. <clears throat> and you were terrified of flying on it. What? Stuff and nonsense. <laughs> Soren, are you afraid of flying? <laughs> but the, the man's mad. He's wither crazy. <laughs> Well, I suppose I might be mistaken. Mm, I liked you better when you had amnesia. Well, that was exciting. Uh, by exciting, I assume you mean absurd and unnecessary. Let's go see what he's hiding in there. should be careful. This place could be booby-trapped. Let's just start looking for the enchanting book. A brief history of cubism. Crafting for noobs, revised. A collector's guide to precious gems. None of these are enchanting books. 
how to train your slime. The various uses of mushroom stew? Potionology, volume 24? None of these seem to be enchanting books either. Olivia, any luck? Not really. Ivor has too many books, and there's too few of us looking. How did we end up all split up like this? I feel like we're spreading ourselves too thin. I miss how things used to be. Look, we might be spread thin, but we're all still a team. That's how teams work. Hey, you almost said teamwork. See, we're still funny. We can still get things done. I guess being split up just means we can be in more places at once, right? Kinda like the wither storm. Let's just forget that metaphor. How I learned to stop worrying and love mining. The unabridged redstone encyclopedia. Zombies and pigs and intimate memoir. I think I'm in the wrong part of the house. Find anything yet? Huh, in this mess? Uh, it's as though Ivor learned nothing from my lectures on organizational methodology. If only he hadn't tried to fight those cursed witches, he could just tell us where the book is. Coming here was his idea. He should be here for it. He can be pretty stupid for someone so smart. Yes! And this house is a perfect example! There's neither rhyme nor reason to how these books are stored. Finding anything here is impossible. Tedious, maybe. Impossible? No way. Fine, I will continue this monotonous search. But I reserve my right to grumble about it. It's a deal. Twenty thousand blocks under the sea. Learn to succeed by thinking inside the box? Gotta be missing something. This Ivor character. I'm recalling that he knew something about potions. Could one of these stop the wither monsters? I'm remembering correctly, am I not? We actually already tried that. I assume it was unsuccessful. Ivor's potions just aren't strong enough to undo this mess he created. Oh, I see. Potion of blindness. Potion of dullness. Potion of nausea. None of these will help me. Jesse, am I going to be all right? Or is this just who I am now? Don't worry. We're going to find a way to fix you. You and... Petra and everyone else the Witherstorm affected. But to do that, you'll need to destroy the command block, will you not? So that's exactly what we'll do. You never stop fighting. I admire that. Hmm, wonder what's in there. Hey, Olivia, I think there's some redstone over here. Looks like a circuit. We probably just need a lever to power it. Too bad I don't have one. Yeah, no lever, no functioning circuit. Hmm, wonder what's in there. Wood planks, those will be useful. First, I'll need some sticks. Okay, got the sticks. go. Good old-fashioned lever. Like it was made for it, which it was. Let's 
see what this sucker does. build a secret passage in a house that nobody ever visits more like why wouldn't you secret passageways are cool good point what the are you guys okay we're fine but the lever isn't working anymore Stay there! We'll head down and see what we can find! Whoa! What is all this? Huh! Incredible! He's gathered them all in one place! Gathered... what, exactly? The treasures of the Order of the Stone! Stories I could tell about these dusty old things. I don't see any enchanting books, though. Maybe through there? Uh, locked, of course. There must be some way to open it. So why does Ivor have the treasures of the Order of the Stone? Did he steal them? No, 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 no. We, we let him keep them when we split up. You let him keep your treasures? Frankly, Jesse, it's a long story. So where'd this packed ice come from? Well, we brought it back from the Ice Plains Spikes biome. It was colder there than anywhere we'd ever been, but <laughs> Magnus slipped so many times our laughter kept us warm. After that, we knew we were ready to face the Ender Dragon. Jesse, what are you doing? Uh, taking this really cool, rare item? We might need it to unlock that door. Mm, very well. Just be careful with it. See? These are prismarine crystals. You can only get these underwater, right? Precisely. We nearly ran out of oxygen getting these. <laughs> Eligard had to use a spare bucket just to grab a few extra breaths. We used most of these to craft a sea lantern. This is all that remained. Prismarine is such a cool word. Prismarine. Am I crazy, or is this a sea lantern? Ah, the very same one the Order built all those years ago. We were so green back then. It looks just as bright as on the day we crafted it. A sea lantern, huh? These gas tears, they're super hard to get. You don't know the half of it. It was our first official mission as the Order of the Stone. We fought those ghasts for hours, and these tears were our reward. Wow. Just gotta borrow this. Sorry, is this the actual Ender Dragon egg? Huh, alas, yes. The only thing that remains of our final adventure together. No way I'm leaving this behind. Aha! A hopper! Why is Ivor hiding a hopper in his basement? Hmm. Huh. Five slots. Ice. Let's put 
put it here. Gassed tears. So let's try them here. A sea lantern. In you go. The Ender Dragon egg. So cool. Let's try it. Huh? Those were the right objects, but I guess it was the wrong order. Prismarine crystals into the hopper. I was so close that time. crystals to make the sea lantern. Nope. Soren said they got this ice just before fighting the Ender Dragon. Soren said this lantern was crafted from prismarine crystals. Hmm. Wait, I think the prismarine crystals have to come before the lantern. The Order used these crystals to make the sea lantern. Sorens of the Order got these gas tears on their very first mission together. Yes! You solved it! But how in the world did you know what order to put them in? There were 120 possible combinations! Everything I needed was in your story. Nice work, Jesse. You know, I often give Ivor a hard time, but for all his complaining, his time with the Order clearly meant a great deal to him. Yeah, I guess so. Anyway, let's go get that enchanting book. By the stars, the Ender Dragon. With replica Ender Crystals and all. Wow, I always wondered what it looked like. Hmm, no way out. Interesting. I pressed all four, but it isn't doing anything. Soren, what's this thing supposed to be? It appears to be an homage to our battle with the Ender Dragon. Despite his anger, Ivor never stopped being fond of us. <laughs> We're missing something here, Soren. And I have a feeling the key might be locked in that head of yours. I have a key locked in my head? What I'm saying is, I think you need to tell me about the Ender Dragon battle. Oh, huh. if only you'd been there. It was a fight 
for the ages. We'd spent weeks preparing for our greatest battle ever. But even so, Ender Dragon was stronger than even I had imagined. I realized that it was drawing strength from the Ender Crystals, and that the crystals had to be destroyed. I hit the first with a perfectly placed arrow. The second I destroyed by launching myself on the shockwave of Magnus' TNT. Using only my strength and my wiles, I steered the foul beast toward the third crystal. I flew the dragon directly toward the final crystal. Only then did Gabriel deliver his famous final blow. Yeah. We became heroes, and eventually, legends. The greatest the world has ever known. Soren, you are so full of it. Why would you say that? For starters, because you're afraid of flying. Ah, oh, okay, but on barges, not dragons. And besides, you made it sound like you were the only one who mattered. I was the leader. Believe you me. Whatever. I wonder if that story will help me solve this puzzle. So Soren rode the dragon, huh? There's another door? Ruben, do you know what to do here? Oh, well, it was worth a shot. Soren, tell me the story again. Certainly. We'd spent weeks preparing for our greatest battle. Uh, sorry, maybe the short version this time? Well, all right. I destroyed one crystal with my bow, the next using a TNT shockwave, the third with Eligard's redstone cannon, the fourth from upon the dragon itself. And then Gabriel poked it dead with a sword. How was that? Better. Thanks. Redstone.
Soren, tell me the story again. Certainly. We'd spent weeks preparing for our greatest battle. Uh, sorry, maybe the short version this time? Well, all right. I destroyed one crystal with my bow, the next using a TNT shockwave, the third with Eligard's redstone cannon, the fourth from upon the dragon itself. And then Gabriel poked it dead with a sword. How was that? Better. Thanks. Hey, Reuben, give me a boost, will ya? No, it, it can't be. Not here. But that's impossible. Ivor couldn't have these in a basement in the Far Lands. Right, Soren? He kept them. The fool actually kept them. He looked me in the eye and swore. Soren, what is all this? What in the world is going on here? Jesse, this isn't... This isn't what it looks like. Our story. Uh, the story. It's, it's mostly true. I swear, I swear it. Whatever you're thinking... I promise I can explain. Soren, I want the truth, and I want it now. I, I can't. We swore never to speak of it. I don't care. Yeah. I'm afraid I haven't been honest with you, Jesse. We did defeat the Ender Dragon, but it, it wasn't exactly like I said. How not exactly? We got rid of it, but we didn't kill it, per se. In fact, we didn't even fight it. We didn't even try. So what did you do to it? We didn't do anything. We used that damned command block. You used the command block to defeat the Ender Dragon? I'm afraid so. I knew your story didn't add up. Understand. When I found that blasted block, we were nobodies. But with its help, we became stronger, faster. We could do so much more. The others had no idea what I was doing. Yet the more I used it, the more we came to depend on it. I knew it was only so long before someone would find out. So, I concocted a plan. I would use the command block to blink the Ender Dragon out of existence. <laughs> Securing our status as legends forever. We told the world we defeated a dragon. And the rest is history. Sorry. You cheated. You... you worse than cheated. You're a fraud. Believe me. I know. So you finally admit it. Soren, how could you? Ivor. How long have you guys been standing there? 
long enough that they heard the whole thing. So we're liars. All of us. You didn't think you could keep it secret forever, did you, Soren? The truth hurts, doesn't it? You knew about all of this, didn't you, Ivor? Of course I knew about it. I was in the Order from the very beginning. Soren, Gabriel, Magnus, Eligard, they agreed to keep this a secret. How conniving of us. And you, you agreed to stay quiet too, in exchange for all of our treasures. <gasps> I've technically never told anybody. Jesse discovered the truth on his own. So this whole thing, the wither you unleashed, it's all been to teach the Order a lesson? To teach the world a lesson! To show you who the Order really are. Liars, cowards! And now, they know! You know, I kinda regret punching you right now. Yes, well, you weren't the first. No one ever seems to appreciate my good intentions. Might have something to do with the casual way in which you unleashed Armageddon? Wither plan obviously backfired. You think? I didn't know we'd end up with three of those things tearing the world apart. For a moment, I nearly forgot. But right now, my friends are out there, facing that monster you created. So however we got here, we need to move on. Jesse's right. Destroying the command block is all that matters anymore. How ironic that the best thing the command block gave us to destroy it. Spare us the poetry. It's not your strong suit. I've had this book for years. This thing better work because if it doesn't, you don't need to say it. Follow me. I'll show you. Ivor, I'm sorry. About everything. Yes, well, it doesn't matter now. Grab some ingredients and craft a weapon. I'll show you how to enchant it. Sweet. Let's see what Ivor's got in here. Let's see, there's a bunch of crafting stuff and... Diamond score! <laughs> so, I can craft whatever I want, huh? Anything at all. I could a uh, pickaxe, a shovel. Awesome! I've never owned a diamond weapon. Just wait till you enchant it. Let's see what this enchanting book is made of. Diamond sword! Yes, that should do the job nicely. But if you're fighting those wither monsters head on, you'll want better armor too. I enchanted these for the order. They're about as strong as it comes. Even able to withstand TNT. Any preference? I have eight different sets to choose from. And believe me, they're all excellent. You won't go wrong, whatever you choose. All right, let me take a look at him. It's all quite durable and sturdy. They won't stop damage, but they'll help. This one is named Golden Goliath. As bright and powerful as the sun itself. That's the Redstone Riot, engineered to be virtually indestructible. All right, this is the set. Yes, a fine choice. Now go ahead and put it on.
I look? Ready for action. You can take some for your friends as well. Sounds good to me. Wow, cool armor, Jesse. Thanks. And there's plenty to go around. Now let's get back to Soren's fortress and see how the Witherstorms are doing against those Endermen. Bit of a numpty waffles. Or a fortress. I see Endermen, so this means the plan's working, right? Shouldn't the Endermen have dismantled those things by now? Or am I just confused? It's not just you. Something's wrong. Jesse, over here! Axel! You guys made it! Nice freaking armor, by the way. Makes you all a lot easier to look at. Good to see you too, Axel. Axel, the cavalry has arrived. Or is it the cavalry have arrived? Eh, whatever. The Endermen, they're not angry enough. I mean, some of them are, but a lot of them are just standing around moving blocks. You know, being Endermen. Ah, oh, blood! They've kept the main weather storm busy, but one of the smaller ones started attacking us. And Magnus ran off to fight that thing, all by himself. He's fighting a weather storm? Alone? Yep, kept saying something about paying for the mistakes of the past, whatever that means. If a fellow member of the Order of the... of the, uh... Order of the Stone? ...is out there fighting, then I belong out there too. Gabriel, no, no, I told you you're not who you think you are. My name <coughs> is Gabriel the Warrior. And he's running the wrong way. Oh, for goodness sake. I'm not letting that idiot get himself killed! Gabriel! Come back here! <sighs> Without the command block, none of them stands a chance. Say what now? Why do they need the command block? I'll explain later. Fine. Hey, uh, you guys didn't check on Petra, did you? <sighs> no, we came straight here. All alone in that cave? I hope she's alright. She will be as long as we destroy the command block. So what's the plan? I mean, I know we gotta go in there, but... We just go for it, or what? We need to find a way for me to use this. Whoa. That is, without question, the coolest thing I have ever, ever seen. Oh, and I brought you some armor, Axel. Here. Nice! I was feeling a little left out. Guys, let's go kick some command block butt. How do you make Enderman focus? I can't even make myself focus. We, we shouldn't be here. None of this is going according to plan. Soren, what are you doing? I, uh, you know, I've, I've really enjoyed meeting you all, but... Soren! Did Soren just run away? Soren, you coward, I can't believe you! So much for the mighty Order of the Stone. It doesn't matter. We have work to do. We need to get those Endermen to attack it! The 
tractor beam! Jesse, that's it! Make them chase you into the tractor beam! How do you like that, you purple-eyed freak? for it. Ah. Yeah. Axel, are those snowballs? Yeah, I found them near the cave. Here. All right, let's see how you like this. Can you give me a little help? Oh. Ah. <laughs> nice one, Ruben. to find you a way up. Ooh, build you a way up. That's it. A everyone, empty your pockets. Let's see. I've got redstone and cobblestone from Ivor's armory. I have some TNT from Boomtown. I've got pistons, repeaters, some wool, some leftover slime. Oh, and I still have that mine cart. That's got to be enough to make something, right? I mean, if we use the TNT on, say... The guys, check it out. Use the pistons, the redstone, and the TNT, build a TNT launcher. And I climb on, and you guys blast me all the way into the wither storm. <laughs> Heck yeah! I love that idea. So what are we waiting for? Let's hurry up and... Oh, look out! Ah! Axel! I got you! Lucas! You're here! Ocelots, distract that wither storm! Hey you! Get a load of this! <laughs> Lucas, thank you! Anything for a friend. Now let's hurry up and build this thing! Done yet? Just need a few more seconds. Okay, it's finished. Quick, climb on. And Jesse, I know you can do this. We all do. Thanks, guys. That means a lot. Now go demolish that command block. <laughs> Ruben, this is no place for us. surprise me like that. On the other hand, I'm kind of glad not to be alone right here. Just stay close, okay?
die at Endercon? Awesome weapon, don't fail me now. Whoa! Didn't I always carry an enchanted weapon? I'm coming, Reuben! He's doing everything he can to protect the command block, which means I have to do everything I can to destroy it. Awesome weapon, don't fail me now. Ruben, I mean it this time. Told you to stay put. Beam. Hey, you! Just watch my back. If anything goes wrong, I'm counting on you. Bet you can't catch me! No, no. 
no, 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 no! Ruben, I need your help! Remember how we used to play fetch? Oh, that's it, that's it! Come on, Ruben, I believe in you! Jump, I'll catch you! You did it! I knew I could count on you! Time to put an end to this thing once and for... Ruben! Hold on, buddy! Jesse, are you all right? We thought you were... I mean, I didn't think he'd made it. Reuben, where's Reuben? I thought he was with you. You did it, Jesse! You actually did it! Hey, do you guys hear something? Reuben! gonna be fine, you hear me? Come on, Reuben, say something. Get up, Reuben, get up. You can't just give up on me. Not now. Jesse, I am... I am so sorry.
People used to look at me like that once, Jesse. Having my memory restored has been both a blessing and a curse. Perhaps they deserve to know the truth about the Order. All those lies we told them. Maybe I should finally come clean. Don't tell them, Gabriel. Just let them have their legend. We all owe a great debt to Jesse and his friends. But I owe a debt to you people as well. Which is why... There is something I want to tell you. About the Order. We may have defeated the Ender Dragon, but that is nothing compared to what these heroes did. They took down a Witherstorm. They are a new generation of heroes. Thank you. Thank you, everyone. I know you think I'm up here because I saved the world or something, but the truth is I didn't do it alone. Far from it. You see, I had my friends with me. It was Olivia, Axel, Petra, Lucas. They never gave up on the world or on me. Well, maybe once or twice. If they only knew. It's crazy to think my friends and I started out in a treehouse, and now we've been to some of the weirdest places in the world. I mean, come on, we went to the Far Lands. There was this gigantic wall and a huge maze and a model of the ender dragon that well you just had to be there but when all was said and done you know what really mattered finishing what we set out to do because there's no way we were going to let a world this cool get torn apart we did it <laughs> Jesse, this is the Nether Star that dropped when the Wither Storm was destroyed. You want to do the honors? Oh man, this is going to be so cool. to introduce to you the new order of the stone and so it was that a new order of the stone was born one whose adventures were only just beginning for though the world had been saved, and the command block destroyed, there are many more worlds than just this one.